what is up everybody welcome back to fallout 4 vr i'm checking out mad gods overhaul again this is the modern something i don't know i forgot what it's called there's so many damn lists that i have i just get confused but i know there's a, a mad god there somewhere so anyhow all right uh it's gonna be back it's been god it felt like an eternity I've been doing a lot of weird stuff lately. Mostly modding games. Uh, I've been playing the crap out of... Stop it, Ivy. Uh, I've been playing the crap out of games like Elden Ring and, you know... No, it's that little kid. The new DLC, as you know, is coming out for Elden Ring. So I've been trying to complete as much you know as much as i can the regular base version of the game in preparation for the new dlc stop it ivy <laughs> so uh yeah all right uh i needed to do something different i was thinking about playing red dead redemption 2 but i'm kind of dreading playing it because after spending so much time like well over a week straight trying to mod the game i i'm afraid to try it now because i know it's gonna crash and i'm gonna feel really bad and because of my compulsive personality i will invest another week to try to mod the game to perfection knowing that it will never be perfect so i think it's best i just kind of just stay away from that game which sucks because it's probably one of the most graphically impressive games that i've ever played so far one one of the most impressive that elder ring new dlc looks amazing by the way too but they're different kinds of games you can't really compare but if you want i guess realism to a certain extent red dead redemption 2 is, is well i don't know how realistic would it be but you know what makes it different and authentic is maybe it's the time setting you know what i mean the 1800s the wild wild west i guess it's just uh it's different it's different and some of the vistas and the environments just look jaw-dropping in that game so all right anyhow uh i'm just gonna continue just i'm gonna play for like a little about an hour i in what did i do i put in some new mods easy stop it ivy <laughs> stop it <laughs> i installed i replaced the scopes for this not that mad god did a bad job but he has a default scopes for vr and it doesn't it's not like this it's just basically when you have a scope and you put it up to your face it gives you like a flat screen kind of scope and you see a black like a blackened area all around it and it's it's not yeah it, it doesn't feel very immersive and it really breaks the immersion in my opinion so i decided to take it upon myself to mess around and i found uh what am where is it damn it i can't really see my list and i i don't want to take my vr headset off but uh it, i think it's called better scopes vr and there is ah see-through scopes so what i did is i installed see-through scopes and all pretty much every single one of the um the patches for the the modern weapons that is also uh installed into this particular mod list there's like a lot of modern warfare themed guns in there so you have to have patches for it and you know if you want the scopes to work properly so it's about i don't know 12 maybe yeah it's a lot so if you're low on esp plugins i i suggest you not try it but that's what you pretty much have to do uh install the see-through scopes and then install all the patches which it's a it's called a foam mod i think for the see-through scopes so it automatically detects which weapon add-ons you have so therefore it will automatically install the patches for you so it's easy peasy after that then i what i did was i installed the better scopes vr on top of that so it, it overrid it so yeah now I have this. It just makes it makes it more compatible, I guess. So yeah, it looks great in my opinion. This is the way it's meant to be played. And I fixed my frick settings where yeah, I can just grab hmm, nice place. the handle here and it kind of stays. And let me test out the alignment for this. Yeah. It's aligned pretty well. And what would make this better is if i had my gun stock which i do have it i'm actually looking at it right under my visor next to me but i i don't want to you know take my headset off and put it on it's it's a bit of a pain but yeah i'm just testing out this mod list to see if everything works and so far so good what else did i add uh yeah i added uh come here ivy i added a um what? don't be shy come here come on i added a a uh, collar <laughs> for her <laughs> Bruh. No, it's not that kind of collar. It's just like, it looks like Bruh. jewelry, I guess. Okay. And I thought it was kind of pretty, so. Um, Bruh. Yeah, no, 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 no funny, you know, seriously, no funny business intended. I, I really, I thought it was jewelry. I mean, it looks like jewelry. <laughs> it does kind of look like jewelry, like a necklace, so I thought that was kind of cool. No shit. It came with some of the outfits, so I said, why not? And yeah, dog meets here. 
I added the companion mod, which adds basically, uh, you can have it. Excuse me? You talking to me? Yeah, he's talking to me. All right, so I added a companion mod, and it allows you to, to bring like five, maybe ten, I don't know, companions at a time. So let me put this gun away because I don't want to accidentally shoot somebody and then have to start over. Okay. I'm playing in a virtual desktop, and to me, it looks the best when it comes to Steam VR. The only time I'll use the cable is with, uh, if I'm playing VR mods like Luke Ross or the UE VR mod. But I'm going to check inside here. No, wrong one. I'm thinking I'm playing Skyrim. I'm used to the grip being the interact button. I'm going to check inside here. I forgot. I th think I have to get Valentine. Yeah, I do, actually. Okay. His tie. Hey, Ellie. Something wrong? Another stray coming in from the rain. Stray? Jeez. Afraid you're too late. Office is closed. She looks... Okay, she looks... Every time I play this game, she always looks different. Uh, who are you? Wait, who are you? You the detective? Me? No, I'm Nick's secretary. And the hell's wrong with her eyebrows? Papers, that sort of thing. That looks well, really weird. That's what I used to do anyway, but... Is that hair on the side of her face? Or is that supposed to be... I think it's supposed to be sweat. Without a detective. Missing? Uh, this just keeps getting worse. Uh, any clues? Do you have any idea how I could find him? He disappeared working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman... And as usual, the facial the animations are pretty sweet. I no added the, um... Expressive facial animations for this. Nick he was walking into a trap, but I think altogether, I think I added like 50 extra mods. Like does. I, I gotta count. But yeah, if, any, if anybody wants to know which ones I added, which ones are compatible, I've been doing it for so long now, so I know which ones are compatible and which ones aren't. So if anybody wants an added list, uh, I'll be more than happy to, I guess, maybe type out some kind of text document for y'all. And maybe I'll upload it to my Google Drive and you can download it and take a look at it. All right, so... Look, uh, I, I gotta pack up. All right, wait, wait, all right. Ask for money. Sure, why not? Hey, I'd love to help, but there's a small matter of expenses. Money, huh? Money? I do Dinero? 125 caps in the old rainy day fund. More money. <laughs> More on. money. This is your boss's life we're talking about here. Fine. We'll make it 150 caps. No, even more money. No, I'm not going to do that. That's, that's messed up. All right, I'll do it. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat getup. Please hurry. His facial animations are kind of creepy. But, uh, super immersive, though. All right, let me see. I always grab that Robco here. Take. Nice find. There is a cigarette mod that I want to try, that I want to add. And that allows you to actually smoke cigarettes in reverse reality. Ivy, where the hell are you? Oh, there she is. See if... Okay, make sure the flashlight's working. Alright, let's go, Ivy. We gotta get Valentine. Valentine's in trouble. He needs our help. He needs our help for the 30th time. Just like in my other videos on my playlist. Or, you know, maybe Broke I won't... Oh, you this guy's gonna get his head blown off. Where's my brother? I swear, I'm not a sin. Don't shoot, for Please. God's sake, for family! Put the gun down, now! He's a sin! He'll kill us all! Here we go. No! Okay. Okay, show's over. Nothing to see there here. No sins in Diamond City. Hear me? You folks Blood there. looks almost no pink. Sense. I added a retexture mod that gets rid of, like, some kind of silver. Um, it's like a, it gives, like, a silver tint to the blood. I don't know. It, it's supposed to make the blood a little, a little more red and realistic, so I just wanted to give it a try. It doesn't, it doesn't have any ESPs involved. So, or no additional plugins. So I figured, you know what, why not? It's a simple retexture mod, and I can't really tell. Because everything around here looks kind of red, anyways. I need you to step away. I know I'm a. Oh, she's the butcher. Polly. 
damn waste of life is what it is. Okay. I don't ever remember Polly wearing glasses. And she looks a bit cleaner. Same kind of haircut, though. But, yeah, her, her eyes are never that weirded out and bugged out like that. And she definitely wasn't wearing glasses. All right, I'm going to leave Diamond City and... Uh, I don't know. Let me see where I should go. So I heard about the Freedom Trail. It's supposed to lead to the railroad. I think we should investigate. Okay, talk to settlers, settlers at Ten, po Ten Pines Bluff. You know, let me do that, I guess, real quick. I don't know. Like I said, I'm only going to be playing for just... Uh-oh. Yo. Oh no. There's no fast travel? Okay, why is... That place is working. Ah, that's weird. Alright. It wasn't working before. Alright, I'll talk to the settlers real quick. At least start that one off. And maybe I'll roam around. Test out different areas at least. I'm going to be honest with you. I really don't feel like doing the Nick Valentine. Uh, the That main... That mission. Because it's... I don't know. It's just... I, I've done it so many friggin' times. It's just kind of... It's kind of boring. And wow, the... Fauna looks great. Alright, test out the crouch. Alright, I, I fixed... If anybody needs to know how I fixed the crouch button... Well... Some people... If, if you're playing... Some people play the game standing, so they want to f actually physically crouch. But for me, I always play sitting down, so I like to just use a stick to crouch. And yeah. It changes the height accordingly, so I know when I'm crouching, when I'm not. And I removed part of the HUD that gets rid of that, you know, that icon signifying that you are crouching. It looks like an eye symbol, like an all-seeing eye, I guess. And I always found that to be distracting. Now, let me put my gun away. Scare these poor settlers away. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Easy. I come in peace. What is she doing? Why? Why was she pointing a gun? See, I had a gun. That's why. All right. Excuse me. What do you want? We don't need any more trouble around here. Uh, Minutemen? Do you always point a gun at everyone you meet? I'm afraid I do these days. If we lose any more of our crops, we'll be done for. Now you best get yourself on down the road. We've got nothing for you. Didn't you ask the Minutemen for help? You're with the Minutemen? I didn't really think... Yes, you because I through. tend to only last a minute. I sent word with one of them passing <clears throat> traders, but honestly, I never expected anything to come of it. Most people don't put much stock in the Minutemen these days after Quincy. Bad business, that. Is there something you need my help with? <sighs> yeah, I'm damn glad you're here. There's a raider gang that's been giving us trouble for weeks. Stealing food and supplies, threatening to kill us all if we don't pony up. We know where they're coming from, but we can't go up against a gang like that. Will you be willing to join the Minutemen once I've dealt with those raiders? Well, we'll certainly give it a good long think. People have gotten used to not being able to count on you folks. That's not going to change overnight. Got to get you some new shoes soon. What's wrong with this barbecue? Looks like there's blood splatters. There are blood spatters all over it. <clears throat> I knew you would help us. Did you know? Oh, look at the crops. What are these supposed to Oh, I... Th oh, they're friggin' tomatoes. Alright. Let me see where I have to go. Corvega. I I don't feel like doing Corvega. It's this that place is huge, man. 
man. Oh, jeez. All right, you know what? Let me see if there's anything else I can do. Unlikely Valentine. I don't want to do that. Road to Freedom. That's the general kind of uh, quest thingy. Story this. Oh, go to Piper's office. Well, I guess. Okay, you know what? Let me talk to Piper. I forgot to start her thing off, and at least I can get her to become a follower, at least. Alright, proceed to Cambridge. That is for the Brotherhood of Steel. Oh, you know what? I'll go for... I'll find Piper next. Let me find Heather, because I added some new textures. I changed her body type and gave her some uh, <clears throat> new outfits. Let's put it that way. And I even gave her an alternate look, so I want to see if that works. And there she is, so I'm going to have to go to the Rotten Landfill first. All right. What is she shooting at? Stop it, Ivy. Huh? Okay, I'm gonna have to get rid of that green tint. I don't like that shit. in here. Huh. I don't remember being in here. Huh. It's pretty cool. What's in here? Ooh, ammo. All right, that's what I was going to do. I'm gonna try to see if I can. It smells like dead grandmother here. <laughs> Real dead grandmother, Jesus. It's an interesting way to put it. Uh, where is the? I forget what it's called. Let's see settings. Mm. Mm, that's not it. No, it's not the G terminal. Color climax? What the hell is that? I don't want to find out. I have a feeling it's, uh, you know, something funny. Brick configuration? No, that's not it either. You know, I might have to make or create the settings from a, a workbench. Uh, that shit sucks. No, it's not in the trunk. Shite.
All right, I don't know where it is, so... Frig, man. It's not Knack. It's not the Knack settings, that's the weather mod. Oh. All right, let me find Heather. I think she's down there somewhere. Yep, directly ahead of me. Okay, I thought there was that brown, like a brown face glitch for a second, so that her, her face is dirty. Where is she? She's supposed to be here. Heather? Where the hell are you? There she is. Alright, let me see what the hell she's wearing. Wee. Eh. It's alright. It's... She doesn't change. Okay. Well, yeah. It, apparently, her default outfit doesn't change. It's just a little more revealing. Like it shows her stomach area. It's actually pretty cool. Oh, dude. Okay, she's a... Uh, a blonde? You know, I don't know. She just kind of looks like, I don't know, too plasticky, kind of clean. Yeah, she looks too, too good. Kind of OnlyFans good. I like, I kind of preferred her other look a little more. I don't know why. It, it really grew on me. She had, like, a more plain Jane kind of girl next door kind of look that I liked. I mean, I, I mean I'm not going to change it now. Fuck it. I have another mod list anyways that she's, I didn't I didn't really touch, so she should look her normal self. All right. <clears throat> I carry the highest quality alternative medicine products. She's still got the same damn voice, though. Today. Interested? So you're a doctor, huh? So you're a doctor? No, I'm not a doctor. Traditional medicine is adequate if that's all you have, but I offer... Yeah, I don't know. Her, much, there's way too much makeup, too. Her face is, like, freaking caked. Traditional medicine cures you today. Alternative medicine can improve... She even has freaking lip liner. ...and vitality forever. And the eyeshadow. This is a little Trust bit too much. Me. Use my healing preparations often enough, and you will see an improvement in Dude, your Dude, and those freaking eyebrows. I have a question for you. Say you find a little kid. Uh, yeah, okay. she looks like a freaking clown. He's all alone. Hasn't eaten in days. Scared to death. When you walk up to him, you can see he has a nice little collection of stolen goods. What do you do? I don't know. I picked the boy's pocket. There you go. Then turn him over. I don't I know. I give the boy a hug and tell him everything will be okay. Hmm. Sounds like something a synth might say. I think I Is added a morality system paid? to this now. Car it's called karma. I get tells so I, I'm going to try my best headed? to be on my best behavior. I don't know. I'm tracking a murderer. The bastard who shot my wife took my son. I don't even have a clue who he is or, or where he's gone. Bet you a hundred caps the Institute was behind it. Their sins are a fucking plague on the Commonwealth. I'll help you track him if you want. I'd love nothing better than to bag one of those murdering, kidnapping sons of bitches. Mm. I don't know. A man took Sean, not some shadowy group. Yeah, well, that man may have been a synth. It's nearly impossible to tell the difference between a third gen synth and a human. I need a partner. Someone to watch my back? I'll give you a discount on my products in 200 caps if you'll join me. I need to get off the camera. So crazy. And I need to. Kind of reminds me. When human beings get tired of being like racist and discriminatory towards one another, the next logical step is they're gonna they're gonna start discriminating against AI and synthetic human beings, which is already happening. All right, uh, I think you need to. I don't know. 
I yeah, think okay. You need to sweeten the deal. I like your style. I'll pitch in another 200 cash. It's out of that. Or it's aliens next. Oh. Will you take my offer? Team up with me? Yeah, yeah. Sounds All right. good. Let's go. Sounds fucking tastic. The name's Kasdan. I've done Heather. this like a billion Kasdan. times, too. Nice to meet you. Been on the road my whole life. Been training with weapons my whole life. If something is going on in the Commonwealth, I know about it. Traders love to gossip. I have a newspaper article for you to read. I don't want to talk about it, but it's true. Someone did get out, and it was me. Thought you might like to know why I'm trigger happy around sips. Oh, one more thing. I've got a transponder for you to carry. Flick it on, and I'll be able to track you if we get separated. Oh, yeah, That's I it. just want to That's be tracked. Got. It's time to rock and roll. There goes my privacy. You look pretty tough. Welcome aboard. It's not talking to me. She must be talking to my dog. Or she's talking to Ivy. She's probably talking to Ivy. See, Ivy? I told you that collar would make you look tough. <laughs> told you that collar would make you look tough. Usually not much going on out here. You know? Nice and peaceful. It's a fucking manhouse south of the river. Hey, kitty cat. <gasps> Look at you. Hello. Dude, the cat's got a friggin' handkerchief. Handkerchief? Handkerchief? You said, wait, is it pronounced handkerchief or handkerchief? It's handkerchief. And he's got a half-eaten fish head. Can't grab it, though. Wait. Okay. It's, yeah. I thought maybe it was like a statue or something. No, it's... It's tail is moving. Doesn't react. Nah, there's no collision. Yeah, it's alive. Yo, this is crazy, man. Seeing this in, in freaking virtual reality is something. I, I swear to God, this will never get old. <laughs> All right. Enough cat seeing. I was in here. What the f What the hell was that? I'm gonna miss Wolfgang. I haven't trusted most of the traders for a long time now. Oh, what's this? But he was okay. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Oh. That was messy. Okay. That's messed up. It's like a cat head. A cat's head. Oh, there's a lot of heads here. Dog head, human head, or a ghoul head. Yeah, he's, this guy's making some kind of weird taxidermy thingy out of a. What do you call these things? Mausoleum. I don't know. I don't like her as a blonde, I don't think. There's a detective in Diamond City we have to go see. If anyone can help me find this guy I'm tracking, it'll be him. Not that I have anything as blondes now, so don't don't cancel me for saying that. Just my opinion. Oh, I forgot. You can't have opinions anymore these days without offending somebody, so... There's nothing I can do about that. doesn't open. Folks say there's a palace down south somewhere. Like in a storybook, you know? She talks a lot. I 
I think there's only a pre con uh, a predefined path NPCs can follow. I forgot what it's called in programming or game development. And I had a bit of uh, a bit of wind for Knack X. It's for the Knack X weather mod. You can add um, it it's adds a, a bit of wind, just uh, just as a, as the title states. I think that's that really adds more immersion to it to the game. I think. Yeah, it's subtle. Well, There's this depends. Running around killing depends on the weather, I guess. Sounds like just another day in the Commonwealth, right? But it's not. It's really. All right, tour the Commonwealth. All right, I uh, yeah, she wants me to take her to different places. So we'll. St I'm gonna stop at Diamond City first. Read the newspaper article, Heather. Or what? Okay. I could find it. No. Probably miscellaneous, right? Ah, here it is. This is it. Okay. I am not reading that. Hey, kills them. be with me for a bit. Alright, here's a tour. It's a calling card, so... Mysterious note. Everyone knows it was him. There's this guy named... Alright, where is my map? Map. Where am I gonna go? Diamond City. Alright. Diamond City. Might as well pick up. She's in here. Got nothing better to do. Hey, be nice, kid. Hey, there she is. Piper. Piper. Hi. You holding up, Blue? Blue? Why are you calling me that? Because you're a vault dweller. I know you're not wearing a blue jumpsuit right now, but the pit boy and the fish out of water look, dead giveaways. So here's the deal. I want an interview. Your life story in print. I think it's time Diamond City had a little outside perspective on the Commonwealth. You do that. The shadow behind her is pretty cool. Uh, I'll tell you what. I'll come with you. Watch your back while you get used to the world above ground. Yeah, we're just All right, Piper. Right, I'm in. Good. Let's get down to business. So, I know you're from a vault. How would you describe your time on the inside? We were frozen. It was normal. My family and I were frozen. I didn't spend much time in the vault. W wait. <laughs> they boxed you up in a fridge? The whole time? Are you saying you were alive before the war? The war? Which war? The one that gave us this lovely landscape of demolished buildings and nuclear radiation every 10 feet? You're telling me you yeah, saw good point. everything before they blasted it into pieces? Yes. I'm over 200 years old. Oh my god. The man out of time. So, you've seen the Commonwealth, Diamond City. How does it compare to your old life? 
fun destroying things. I've been having too much fun blowing things up to think about it. Gotta make my job hard for me, huh? <laughs> All right, if that's the quote. Ooh, that's your cheekbone looks a little strange on the left side of the face. Oh, well, the big question. You came all this way looking for someone. Who is it? I lost family, okay? I'm trying to get one of them back. What's their name, Blue? Oh, aren't you nosy? Who are they? My son, Sean, was kidnapped. He's not even a year old. The parent after the missing child. As heartbreaking today as it ever was. Tell me, do you suspect the Institute's involved? The Institute? Who were they? That, Blue, is the biggest mystery in the Commonwealth. No one really knows who or where they are, but their handiwork is all over. Since. Thanks. Everybody's skin looks really shiny. Sent from their hidden labs to do the Institute's dirty work. Sometimes they even replace a person with a synth double. A little covert agent no one would ever suspect. Now, not everything that goes wrong has the Institute behind it, but there's always a chance. That's why I'm asking. Sure sounds like they might be. Not even a baby is safe from them. And people wonder why I can't just look the other way. For the last part of our interview, I'd like to do something different. I want you to make a statement to Diamond City directly. The threat of kidnapping is all but ignored in the Commonwealth. Everyone wants to pretend it just doesn't happen. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? Find who's responsible and make them pay. Simple as that. I'll take anger or yeah. apathy. That sounds Christian. Day. Good quote. Thanks, Blue. That's everything. It's going to take some time to put this all together, but I think your story is going to give Diamond City plenty to talk about. Anyway, I agreed to come with you, right? Watch your back. Oh, my, her Just say the word when you're ready. Cheekbones look off. I can't wait to see where the story goes next. All right. Let's go. Recruit. Well, this looks cozy. Piper and Matt certainly got their shit together here. All right, I got three ladies and a dog. Let's go, ladies and dog. Anything I can hey. do? You just say the word. Hey, Piper. Cap for your thoughts? Your thoughts? Let me know if there's anything I can do to lighten the load. Or, you know, if you need anything proofread. Nah, I already made too many jokes about that, so I'm not going there. All right, oh, never mind. Sure. Hey, buddy. It's good to see you. Oh, I might as well get Valentine, I guess. I don't know. I don't I don't have any other quest, so. All right, Nick. Miscellaneous. What's this? Hey, who wants to look beautiful? Oh. Hairstyles across the Commonwealth. I think I have to go to Park Place. There it is. Park Place. Swan's Pond. Pond. Let me check that out. I know there's a... I think there's a massive mutant there. Let's check that out. Question for you. Taking long load.
Okay. Boston's not so bad out here on the fringes. There it is, right there. Let me see which... Oh, it's not very hard. Oh, survive. Uh, I don't like survival. Very hard, I'll keep it on. Let me see the performance. Performance. Yeah, everything's on high. Okay. Max particles. All right, we're good, we're good. It's raider than gunners further in. And the occasional Deathclaw or Yagwai. You save it just in case, actually. If you can believe it. All right. That thing right in the water, I think, is a super mutant. Here it is. I don't want to kill it too quick. That's when I have fun with it. Go ahead, ladies. Go get him. <laughs> Go get him. Go get him, dog meat. No, are you serious? All right, my... Okay. My followers are overpowered. That's no fun. That is no fun. Free for the taking. Power fist. What is all this crap? I don't need any of that stuff. What was that? Nah. All right, that's. Oh man. I'm gonna have to get rid of some followers because there's no there's no freaking challenge anymore. Torn letter. Child dog me. That's it. All right, where's Park Place? Could have sworn there was a robot around here, too. Here it is. Oh. Stay sharp. Never know what's around the next corner. Welcome, Patriot, to Boston Common. The start of the Freedom Trail. Feast your ears and learn more about the historic Freedom Trail. Hey, look at all the components. The That's cool. Of Boston Common. A tour guide? You're a tour guide? Error. Response not recognized. A robotic tour guide. All right. Welcome, Patriot, to Boston Common. The start of the Freedom Trail. Tell me about the Freedom Trail. Starting here at Boston Common, follow the red path as it winds its way through our great city's streets. Markers on the trail are placed at many famous historic sites. See Paul Revere's house, the old North Church, the old State House, Bunker Hill, 
and many more. That's it. Welcome, Patriot, to Boston Common. The start of the. All right, this is getting a bit repetitive. I'm interested in the history of this place. Let us go back hundreds of years. It is the year 1775. For seven years, thousands of British soldiers have camped on this very soil in their orderly rows of tents led by General Thomas Gage. They seek to quell the growing tide of revolution the night of April. Oh, hurry 17th. up. All right, you know, I could skip this. The officers are assembled, General Gage. Four days prior, oh. I received oh. word from the Earl of Dartmouth. We have our orders. Lieutenant Colonel Smith, gather 21 companies of our best men and carry them with the utmost expedition and secrecy to Concord. Once there, you will seize and destroy all artillery, ammunition, provisions, tents, small arms, and all military stores. But what of the colonists, General? Take care that the soldiers do not plunder the inhabitants or hurt private property. But we can and must defang them. So, near midnight, Colonel Smith marched with 700 redcoats to face brave American patriots in the Battle really cool. of Lexington and Concord. Always and moving the mechanical parts inside war. Began his helmet thing continue on the trail to walk through more of our great city's history. Ah, uh, we're done. All right, I don't know. Surprisingly, the performance is not all that bad here. Usually, downtown Boston is horrendous. But then again, I mean, I I have I'm. I'm playing on a 4090, so. All right, I can see a little bit of dips. Oh, no. Turn around. Wake up, Piper. Oh, look at his brains, bro. That is so cool. Actually, I am.
shit. Stimpak. Oh, damn. Piper. Come on, get up, Piper. Get back in the action. Down here. What's this? Ah. Um. <clears throat> Stop. Stop. Don't say it. I know she's gonna say it. Oh no! See. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> Some poor slob shot his load on her. Stop it, stop it, Ivy. You're gonna get me demonetized, damn it. Fuck. I really Ooh. miss fresh pornography. Zombie safe for covered up. They covered up. But regardless of the cum stains, stop it, Ivy. I am trying to shoot, and she's talking about cum stains. Gorgeous. Shoot, cum stain. Oh, geez. Never mind. She's still going on. Right, I'm gonna try a different weapon. I have to add a couple more mods. One of them's called Cross Crit. Cross Grit or Cross Crit Gore. Basically is like uh the way Skyrim VR works with with uh, the mod that it depending on on what you use, like the spells, whether it's fire, or electricity, it creates like particle effects. And if you burn an NPC to death, an enemy enemy NPC, it will disintegrate its body. I forgot the name of the mod for Skyrim. That does that, but it's basically the same thing. Like if you use a, you've probably seen in my other videos. If you use a plasma rifle, it disintegrates the enemy, and you'll see it'll leave its uh, skeleton. And I'm gonna try a different weapon. I'm gonna try that one. All right, I got so distracted. I, uh, sorry, dog, me move. I gotta pick up Valentine at Park Place. Let's 
think it's back this way. Yeah. He's a good boy. Nice, nice. Nice. I'm picking up adhesives in, <laughs> in the area. Sweet. Sweet. Got him? Nice. Damn, they're pretty good shots. That's an eagle. Lighting here is superb. Oh, damn, I'm out of bullets. Shit. Um, AK? Hmm.
wonder what kind of evil shenanigans Vault Tech got up to in here. Out dog meat. So, platform went right through him, and he's stuck. God damn! It, I hate it when they open the door. Why is that thing so loud? What does it? Because they weren't planning to use it, you moron. Was that? No, she was a fell. Generations lived in here before they opened up the vault and left. But they were sorry when they got outside. Well, it's nice and safe. You're welcome. If 
performs not very good in here. Hey! Here he is. Come all this way, risk life and limb. Because it's part of this crypt. Is he another synth? Like no, me? no. What would make you think that, Ivy? Whoa. What? What are you? Told you, I'm a detective. Look, I know the skin and the metal parts ain't comforting, but it's not important right now. The only thing that matters is why you went to all this trouble to cut me loose. I need you to find someone, but it's complicated. I don't exactly know where they could be or how long they've been gone. Well, I've done jobs with less. Somehow nice and simple never makes it onto the menu in my world. What are you doing locked inside this office anyway? Couldn't you find a way out? I've been cooped up in here for weeks. <laughs> Turns out the runaway I know how that I feels. here to find wasn't kidnapped. She's Skinny Malone's Except new I knew her. I've been doing it since 2008. She's got a mean streak. Anyway, you got troubles, and I'm glad to help. But now ain't the time. Let's blow this joint. Then we'll talk. Nick, I need your help to find a guy named Kellogg. After we deal with these characters. What's their story? Malone's crew here used to be small time. Muscled out of the old neighborhood by bigger players. So they found this place. Don't know what happened to the previous owners, but they're not exactly around the charge. The stuff you found, right? Wait, I forgot if that door is open. I don't think it is. Wait, do I go down here? I think I do. His only job is to check on the prisoner. Why does that take so fucking long? Huh? Hey, Dino, quit razzing that detective and get down here. Dino. Such a Goomba name. Iguana on a stick. Yummy. Astoundingly awesome tales. Issue number eight. That's him. Seriously, good night, Uncle Lips and Diamonds, if you were fancy. Where 
let you go. Ooh, nice shot. This gun's pretty freaking powerful. Really? Hey, 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 hey! Poor dog. Easy. Easy. You okay there? Ooh, Call of Duty points. Oh. That's it. Get him alone, and the rest of his boys are waiting for us somewhere. The name's, uh, ironic. Alright, this is it. Come on, Valentine. Any day now. What is he doing? Let's go. Nick, let's keep moving. Well, I'm waiting for you. Here we go. Another locked door. Shouldn't be too hard. Save it here just in case. I hope that Nick's detective skills are better than his personal hygiene <laughs> skills. He's a smelly robot. Leave him alone. All right, let's go. Shoot up my guys? You have any idea how much this is gonna set me back? I wouldn't be here if it weren't for your two timing game, Skinny. You gotta tell here we go. Home right here. Oh, poor little Valentine. A shame you got beat up by a girl. I'll just run back home. Surprise the AI didn't do anything. Should have left that alone, Nikki. This ain't the old neighborhood. In this vault, I'm king of the castle. You hear me? And I ain't letting some private dick shut us down now that I finally got a good thing going. I told you we should have just killed him! But 
Then you had to get all sentimental. All that stupid crap about the old times. Dala, I'm handling this. Skinny Malone's always got things under control. Oh, yeah? Then what's this guy doing here, huh? Valentine must have brought him here. Getting ready to blow your head off, Darla. Convince her to leave, okay. Darla, listen to me. You have a home to go back to. You don't want to throw your life away with these thugs. I... I... You're right! <laughs> what am I doing? I've gotten all mixed up. Darla! Where... Where are you going? Home, Skinny. Where I should have been all this time. This is goodbye for us. Oh, come on, Nikki. You cost me my men. Now you and your friend cost me my girl. My friend here just did you a favor, Skinny. You always did have bad taste in women. Now that she's not around <laughs> to feed that temper of yours, maybe you'll see sense and let us walk. You still owe me for two weeks in the hole. You smug, overconfident ass. Yeah, yeah. All right, you get to the count of ten. I still see your face after that. I'm gunning both of you down. We better get out of here fast. One. Where are you going, Darla? Two. Come here. I'm not done talking to you. What a mess I got myself into. I can I talk to her? Damn it, what the hell is Ivy doing? I think I have to go through here, right? Yeah, here it is. Better be up there. Come on. Please load. No, that's not good. Yeah, what is going on here? Oh, shit. Oh. Wow. I can't believe it took that long to load. Oh, no. Where are the... Damn it. Valentine, he didn't show up. Shit. Okay, here's Ivy. Where's Valentine? I thought he'd be out here. Crap. Uh, I don't want to go back in there.
Fuck, I'm gonna have to. Damn it, Valentine. Where is he? Are you kidding me? Is f shit. Valentine, where the hell are you? I don't want to fucking reload that shit. Follow Nick Valentine. I don't know where he is, though. Yeah, this main quest line is always glitchy. Now, so, okay, now he teleported up there. That's annoying. Now, hopefully, I have to wait like a friggin' hour. Probably do. Alright, wasn't that bad. Definitely gonna edit it. Edit it out, though. Oh, no. Where is he? Are you f Where did he go? Oh, jeez. Valentine. No, oh, there he is. You, you. Come here. Valentine. Stop it. Hey, Valentine. Are you ready to talk? How do you know to find me down in that old vault? <sighs> Your secretary, Ellie. She sent me. She did? I should give her a raise. She's actually quite hot, you guys. I mean, <laughs> did you see those breasts? Uh, same size as yours, Sorry. Ivy. Yeah, I know. Irrelevant. Continue. Now, you mentioned something about a missing person. No trace of where they've gone. I want you to come to my office in Diamond City. Give me all the details. Besides, I think you've earned a chance to sit down and clear your head. All right, I'll meet you there. I'll meet you there. See you in Diamond City. Oh, what? Dude, this is not the first time I completed it. What the hell? All right. Au revoir. Nos vemos. God, it looks so beautiful. I kind of just want to explore, but I'm recording, so I don't have the luxury to just uh, record as long as I want. Getting these frigging cars. Chase. 
These cars are super dangerous. Oh, is that Valentine? Oh, damn. Damn, you know what? I knew I should have teleported out of here. Damn it. Turret. All right, Valentine, go about your business. I'll meet you there. Oh. Scared the crap out of me. Oh, he's wearing my outfit. Oh, what's this? Shenley's Oyster Bar. Huh, I'm gonna check that out. You know what? Let me save it, actually. Oh, that's nice. Mutilated body. Uh, this place doesn't look very nice, actually. I need a hug. You need a hug? Yeah, it was. No, that's kind of fucked up. Magnets are kind of conflicting. They're, they're both of the magnets on each controller attached to one another. All right, this probably goes to. All right, this is the roof. I mean, let me get out of here. All right, ladies, let's get out of here. Ladies and dog. He's still here. Go home, Valentine. Damn it. Go home. Alright, you know, I'm just gonna teleport there. I don't wanna risk. Oh, she's.
you were in the paper, right? You got 200 years old. Yep, 200 years old. And that psycho chick of his. It's good to be back in the same place. Maybe the hell is she talking about? Who needs a haircut? Everyone needs a haircut. Step up. The hell is Heather doing? Hello? A new file to open. Do you have a legitimate medical concern? Or is this about a facial reconstructive service? Facial reconstruction? What's that? Uh, it's Doc Crocker's specialty. If you're interested, talk to him about it. Just head through the door with our logo on it. Now, if you have an actual medical problem, speak up. So what kind of treatments are common around here? Bandaging wounds and cleaning radiation exposure are the most common things you outsiders usually ask for. That and kicking a chem hat. Patch me up, Doc. Tell me your symptoms. Uh. No Actually, right. never mind, Doc. Fine. Come back later. Prescriptions filled. High quality cams right here. I think I found some new textures for the right away. No, maybe I didn't. I don't know. No, I mean, I did, but I don't know if I activated it or not. All right. Let me continue on with the Valentine quest line. Get it out of the way. Oh, this is, this is going to glitch out. Okay. Well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> you keep laughing at death. Someday death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You oh no. This always happens every single time. It's like sometimes I have to wait for like a, a while before the script kick, uh, the script kicks in. It's it's a little weird. Nick, we really need your help. If you can't figure this out, no one can. What's that glowing thing behind her? Oh, that's pretty cool. I like that. Oh shit, Ellie. Thanks so much for bringing Nick back. Okay. Can we get started on my case? Oh, of course. There's just a small clerical thing we need to clear up. Here. Every cap we agreed to for finding him. Yeah, yeah. Give Plus me. a little something extra. You know, mm -hmm. if you're looking for work and don't mind putting on the detective hat, Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa. One case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. Trying to find someone who's gone missing. The devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can, no matter how painful it might be. I know this is going to suck. I'm right here if you need me. Oh, you're so sweet, Ivy. Thank you. 
Describe kidnapper, describe Sean. My wife was murdered. She was trying to keep them from taking Sean and they, they just- Killed without hesitation or remorse, motherfucker. It's okay, you don't need to say anything more. So we're talking about a group of cold-hearted killers. They waited until something went wrong to resort to violence. Nick looks like a model that came before me. Do you think I came from that place too? The Institute? Do you think that's where Dr. Stein came from? What else can you tell me? We were in a vault when it happened. Vault 111. It was some kind of cryo facility. You were on ice, huh? More importantly, you were underground, sealed up. It's a lot of obstacles to get through just to take one person. Of all the things you can do with test subjects in a vault, they put you in a freezer? Shit, I can think of better things to do. Anything else you remember? There was a man and a woman. They didn't say much, but I remember they called me the backup. So we're talking a small team, professionals, the kind that know to keep their lips tight when they're on the job. Not sure what the backup means, though. Backup? For what? Anything else you remember? We're looking for my son, Sean. Look at Ellie, she's got this weird concerned look in her eye. Why would anyone take him? Good question. Why your family in particular? Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Only a truly sick fuck would kidnap a baby. Motherfuckers. Well, that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. Whoever took your kid had an agenda. Hmm. There's a lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the Gunners. And of course, there's the Institute. Who were the gunners? High-end mercenaries. No job too brutal. They're in the running as likely suspects. They wouldn't be the ones pulling the strings. Super mutants? What are they? Big, green, muscles on muscles. In other words, hard to miss. I think we can safely rule them out. You think raiders might have done this? <laughs> I honestly doubt it. They can barely organize themselves, let alone pull off something this complicated. So you think this institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. Something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Then you got the newer models, good as human, that infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. And I'm a synth myself. A discarded prototype, anyway. You're a prototype? As far as I know. Never seen any other synth like myself. There's the older ones that are dumb as rocks and all metal, and there's the newer ones that are almost human. I'm somewhere in between. You don't know anything about them? Really? Some kind of security setting strips or blocks out those memories. And it's not just me. Any synth that gets trashed, left behind, or escapes the Institute has the same problem. Probably some kind of failsafe. Either way, I need to find Sean. You're right. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? I'll never forget that voice. Low and rough. Like sandpaper across her face. Not much to go on, but a tough and commanding voice can get someone pretty far in the violence business. What else? The man who killed my wife. He had a handgun. I didn't get a clear look at it that sound could have been a large caliber revolver huh 
I'm starting to get a clearer picture of the kind of man our perp is. Anything more you can tell me? The woman was dressed in, um, I think it was a kind of hazard suit. The man had some sort of metal brace on his arm. Like a hazmat. Some kind of improvised hazmat suit. Armor? A lot of hired guns do that to uh, We are tired. Fuck it, after this. The Mercs can afford something that fancy. Ooh. What else do you remember about them? One of them came right up to me. All right. It's, Bald head. it's getting hot, actually, Star under wearing this VR headset. Wait. It couldn't My be. face is getting uh, kind of sweaty. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? One thing that sucks about playing uh, VR games uh, in the summer. Kellogg. Who is he? Do you think he has Sean? Hmm. Way too big of a coincidence. Coincidences are just existence's way of making a joke. Yeah. Never ignore coincidences. Unless you're in a hurry. Then always ignore coincidences. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. And he bought a house here in town, right? And he had a kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned wet stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. Wait, that can't be Sean, right? I mean, Sean's still a baby. You said he lives here? He's still in town? They both vanished a while back, if I'm remembering right. But that house is still there. Let you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two should still be careful. Don't worry, Ellie. I will keep them safe. Besides, it will be just the three of us in that house, and I'm really curious to know about Nick's sexual subroutines. <laughs> of course. I mean, he must have them, and... Hey, Nick, you look like you're always horny. Are you? I always am. <laughs> You've really gone through a lot, haven't you? Hope you and Nick find that monster. Alright, we get the. Uh, where is it? Ah. The Marty Bullfinch case. Marty, Marty Bullfinch. Emphasis on the Wait, there's another case. Oh, some kind here it is. Of to come to us for help after all this time. The Earl Sterling case. Apparently, Earl just up and disappeared one day. No one's seen him since. Is that it? It's gotta be another one. Watch out, doggy. No, I guess that's it. All right. Are you nervous about confronting Kellogg? I'm nervous. All right, let's go. Hey, Valentine. Kellogg's house is this way. Uh, All right, let's go. Oh, come on. Don't glitch out now. Nick. Come on. Kellogg's house ain't far. I'm waiting. Come on, man. Yeah. Follow me. Let's check out this house Kellogg left vacant. So Go, hey, Nick. Valentine. Come on. Kellogg's house ain't far. Go. Need some custom hardware? We got a free workbench for Shit. all your modifications. No Clip sizes. Should I just show up there? Oh, man. Maybe it's because I have too many companions with me. That's gotta be it. Nick. Follow me. Check out this house Kellogg left vacant. Diamond City Circle. Oh, Everything man. you need. 
All right, I want to try going back in and back out again. You two be careful. Miss Perkins. You no, know, I always got the sense Earl was interested in me. Figures he'd be the one to run off. Okay, there he is. All right, good, 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 good. I'm just gonna follow him now. Yeah, that's strange. Sometimes leaving the area and then coming back, you should start or help uh, help the quest kick off. It's a little weird. I don't want to disturb him or interrupt him because he's going through the. Uh, his uh, pre-designated routine now, or script, so if I talk to him, I might kind of interfere with that script and it'll start glitching out again, so. Alright, I'm... Oh, no, come on. No, no, no. Go, 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 go. Nick. How long Charles is this way? You know what it is? It's the freaking dog. The dog's in the way. I knew it. It's the NPCs. <sighs> Come on. Hey, Valentine. Come on. Kellogg's house ain't far. Oh, jeez. See, I don't want to. Oh. All right. You know what? Maybe I should. For the Piper for, for the time being. Hey. Or I will try entering another building or something and then come back out. I don't know. Let me try this. No, that's someone's house. Alright, greenhouse. Fresh plants and veggies. Mm, it smells like weed. Good, good. Okay. Here we are. Keep an eye out, will you? See if I can get this open. That's one heck of a lock. Something to hide, Kellogg? Why don't you give it a try? Nice. Oh, the cheat terminal. Francisco Sunlights. Hmm, interesting brand. Won't lead us anywhere. Any suggestions, Nick? Hmm. What about dog? Oh, nice. Good Nuka Cola. Well, not like him can track a man's scent for miles. Well, dog meat seems eager for the job. Why don't you let him have a whiff? See if he picks up on the trail. Uh, 
before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. If you have to face Kellogg on your own, just say so. Besides, you already have plenty of company. Can't all go sniffing through the Commonwealth after one man. Oh, you're coming with me. I We're all going together. On this, Nick. All right, well, let's get that bastard. This is your show from here on out, okay? You say jump, I'll say how high. That's how I like it, Nick. That's how I intend it to be. Dog meat. Get the scent, boy. Got something, boy? Okay. Find it faster. All right, let's go, ladies and robot. Oh man, now I gotta freaking follow this dog. Like two, three miles an hour. San Francisco sunlights at University Point that day. I'll never. All right, that green icon, that green symbol is kind of annoying. I'm going to turn that off for now. Because I pretty much know what to do from here. Oh, I can turn on. See what happens if I turn all these options up. Yeah, floating markers are called. I'll turn that off. Okay. What are the chances we'd be chasing the same guy? That's weird, but it means we'll get him. No, I know. I know that trick. My olfactory sensors are picking up the same thing. Kellogg was here. San Francisco's. I think dog meat has the scent again. We gotta stick together, pal. At least until we find Kellogg. Okay, boy. Let's track him. Okay.
bloody bandages. Dog meat can track this. Stop cursing. Okay, boy. Let's track him. Looks like this one thought he'd get away. No such luck. Oh, oh, those are these. What are those mongrel dog things? God, the greenery looks beautiful here. Oh, hell no. Yao Guai. Shut up, Ivy. No accounting for Gwyneth Stout. One of his creature comforts. Dog meat picked up the scent again. Kellogg's still out there. We've got to track him, boy. Hmm. What do you think, boy? Enough to go on? All right. I think we're very close, Alert. Master. Alert. I'm ready Critical to fuck up signs. this ass cunt. Stop cussing! I'm behind you. Not sure who started it, but this traitor never stood a chance. It doesn't look like a robbery. Must have just gotten in his way. This didn't do any good for them, did it? What's the matter, boy? Attention, assailant. Lower your weapons immediately. Okay. 
What have we here? Error. System corrupt. I can't feel my legs. Mm, neither can I. What happened here? Error. Operator deceased. Threat level Omega. He killed us. Oh no. Look at that poor thing. What did the bad man do to you, my poor baby? Okay. Mm. That's it. All right. You know what? Closing in on him. Hey. Thanks for taking me with you for this. I know how important Where it is. Where does all go? You. Stop it. You lead. I'll follow. Oh, there it is. What do you think, boy? Was this our man? Damn bloat fly. Give me a bloat fly. Okay, performance is really bad here. Gonna have to. Hmm. Where is it? Lower the performance a bit. It's a particle, baby. I'm not willing to mess around with the shadow quality because that affects the Pip Boy. Maybe. Is it display? Here it is. Yeah, I'm gonna lower down. Way down. Let's see what that does now. Mm, it's not doing much. Alright, done this a billion times. I'm gonna have to call it quits though. Two hours. I've been playing. You. <laughs> really, Ivy? Just fucking with you. <laughs> Just fucking with you. Yeah, you said that twice now. Is this the place? Is he in here, boy? Dog meat's such a good boy, isn't he? <laughs> he can smell a pussy from two miles away. <laughs> That's why I was sure he'd find Kellogg for us. Wow. You are funny, I gotta admit. That's why she's like one of my top favorite characters. I like her too, but I like the old her. I mean, same personality though, you know? Piper, she's a smart ass too. There's a story here, we'll find it. Okay. Dog, what are you doing? 
Dog meat. Everything okay, boy? Everything okay, boy? Come on, boy. It's time to go. All right, gotta find a way up there. Oh, I should know already. It's done it like a million freaking times. Right down here, right? Yeah, it is. That is going to be all. I... Yeah, so I was going to say, that is it. I'm done. It's been, wow, I'm recording for about two hours and 11 minutes, so I'm going to I'm gonna call it a night. My my face is drenched right now, full of sweat, because it's, uh, it's pretty hot here in my room. I thought I had the AC on, but I don't know. Maybe I turned it off. Jesus, again? I'm gonna go back here. See if there's a oh, this is safe. Nice. Yes. Stealth capabilities. That's it. All right. Now, let's try this again. I'll see y'all in the next video. I'll continue probably maybe tomorrow or maybe in a couple days. It's going to take a while for me to edit and then upload this video. All right, take care, everybody. Have a great night. Good night. Bye-bye.